Neighbors living along a popular section of the Atlanta Belt Line, they are upset, now voicing their concerns after a rash of car break-ins. Atlanta News First Don Shipman reports from Atlanta's Old Fourth Ward neighborhood outside the West Inman Lofts. Yeah, I talked with a number of people who live here, and they tell me that this has happened before. In fact, for at least one person who lives here, this is the second time that his car has been vandalized. Nothing was taken, just smashed in window. Colin McClellan has lived in West Inman Lost for two years now. He likes the neighborhood, its proximity to the Beltline, the convenience of everything so close by, but he doesn't like the crime. He and his neighbors showed me the damage done when several vehicles parked in their gated garage were broken into last night. So I still like where I live. Um, do I think like security should be better and we should be doing better things to like make sure that this doesn't happen? Sure. It's just a matter of time before, you know, something worse happens and it really scares me. This isn't the first time Atlanta News First has reported on car break-ins here. Four years ago, vehicles were vandalized at West Inman Lofts. A day after, dozens more were broken into right across the street at another apartment complex. We live in a city, but um, we live at a secure building. And neighbors tell me that they did file a police report with the Atlanta Police Department. We did reach out to the Atlanta Police Department to see where they are with that investigation. In Atlanta's Old Fourth Ward, Don Shipman, Atlanta News First.